there is nothing, I repeat, nothing I love more than coming home to packages. <sighs> I just got home from work and saw two big boxes outside the house. It's not Amazon, it's Softmock and Zara. I needed a thumbnail. So, I ordered a package earlier this week from Zara. I saw this top on Zara that I loved and I was like, oh my god, I need it. It looks so good on the model. It should stay on the model. It is horrendous on me. I, I promise it looked good off, but this is the top. Like, it... Okay, it kind of looks like a tutu down here. But she was like tall and skinny and it looked really good on her. And then I put it on and I looked like a cupcake topper. So, no, 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 no. The idea was cute. But I just, it just, no, it didn't work. So. Uh, okay, so that's being returned, but I heard listening to music in the shower. But the next box, this is a big one. Let's open this up. Okay, I'm not too sure how I feel about what I just got. Oh, my camera's gonna die, that's cute. So first are these jeans. I really like them because they had like this studded kind of addition to them. And the ends have a cute trim to them, but they are a skinny jean, which is fine. Um, it's okay. With this top, what I was going for was the Frankie's top. If you guys know the Frankie's shop, they have this top that is called like the Muscle Tank. It's like always sold out worldwide, aka online. Um, and it's basically like a tank top that has padded shoulders. And it looks something like this. Not so similar. It's more of like a, I think like a different material, like cottony. I don't know. It doesn't have like this kind of texture up here or anything, but it is pretty similar. Um, the problem with the Frankie shop one is it's 75 USD and then 20 USD shipping. And then that doesn't include in case it gets stuck at customs or anything. It's a bit of a fancier material, but it's not terrible. I'm going to see. I may keep it. The jeans I'm going to keep. I got this black silk tank because I wanted to have one to fit over. Um, like a white t-shirt you guys know that style love it. So gonna keep that gonna keep the jeans I just don't know about this top Keep you guys posted though. That's my haul. Oh, and I'll show you my shoes, but my camera's dying So I have to charge it We went to a Revita size. What's a vlog without a Revita size stock? It's not um, and we each got a muffin as well as a immune booster shot Which I need very badly So here it is. Let's struggle. Cheers. Ew. Oh, that's really gingery. My nose is dripping. It's so spicy. Oh. Hello, beautiful. I love you. Hello, beautiful. I love you too. Erin, <laughs> you just got crumbs all over the floor. I almost forgot you at home. We are going downtown now. It's Sunday, you know the ritual. We are going downtown to a coffee shop. It's stunning out today, so I almost forgot my camera. This entire thing was a fail. We went downtown to the place, well, the coffee shop I wanted, but they were closed. Yeah. It closed at three o'clock on a Sunday. Like, that's really rude. And then we went to another coffee shop and the parking was just madness. So now we're going home. So no coffee shop today. Came home and my HelloFresh delivery came and I'm so excited about this. It's so cool how it just comes perfectly packaged each meal. Um, over here are the recipes with the instructions on how to make everything. So the three veggie dishes that I chose are the barbecue ranch Beyond Meat Burger, which looks, hello, stunning. Hello, hello, fresh. <laughs> then I got the warm Mexican bean bowl, which also looks incredible. And lastly, I got the sheet pan tandoori paneer bowl. I'm so not adventurous when it comes to cooking and stuff, so I picked some dishes that I wouldn't normally cook, like a sheet pan tandoori paneer, like I wouldn't cook that. Um, and I just wanted to try different flavors and things, so I chose these three dishes for that purpose. Yep. Bowie, I swear if you bark one more time, I don't know which one I'm gonna make tonight, but it'll be one of these dishes, and I'm so excited. And I'm hungry, so I'd eat that now. I thought I lost you guys, but I left my camera in the car in my sister's parking garage. I got you. We are currently making hamantashins because Purim is tomorrow, and Today. who doesn't love, it's technically tonight and tomorrow. Who doesn't love Sugar and butter and cookies. 
<laughs> when you don't have an electric mixer. So you gotta, uh, you know, just be a little creative. So the recipe calls for an orange, but we didn't have that, so we brought a clementine. <laughs> so we're really uh, DIYing this out here. <laughs> Wait, it's actually working really well. You Isn't would it? never know that it's Maytel <laughs> doing that. Who needs a mixer, Aaron? <laughs> and, uh, Alexa, play pouring music. <laughs> We're getting in the pouring spirit. Shuffling songs by Katy Perry. No! <laughs> Alexa, play songs for the Jewish holiday Purim. <laughs> hmm, I don't know that one. <laughs> okay, that's rude. Look at that dough. Stunning. Wow. We have wrapped the dough and now we are putting it in the fridge for what says three hours, but will not be three hours. A good place to run. Oh, she's just relaxing there. We are just on a walk at a trail now. We're waiting for the dough to just sit in the fridge for a couple hours, so we figured we'd come on a nice stroll since it's a beautiful day. Crumbs. Shaving some halva, making the dough. All these beautiful humming sessions, and then there's Aaron. <laughs> and there they are, these beautiful humming sessions pouring out with halva and Nutella. I'm not pouring out with anything. Aaron, shut up. What is better than some sheet masks? It kind of burns my skin, you? No. Okay. <laughs> Block out all the haters. Came to Zara to return some things, but obviously, obviously I'm trying some things on. I'm loving this leopard print jean jacket for the spring. This is a nice high neck black top as well that I'm gonna be picking up. Um, I thought it actually looked good paired with this. I'm really sorry, I forgot to vlog it. This was avocado toast, and that was burrata cheese. That's it. We are making Hello Fresh. This is the Barbecue Ranch Beyond Meat Burger. Looks stunning. Here are all the ingredients. We're not gonna make fries because like, I don't want to. But yeah, we have the sauce, some crispy shallots, some pickles, and everything. It's delicious. Let's, let's do this. <gasps> Love that for you. Oh my god. Okay, Aaron is making the ranch. So, step three add mayo, sour cream, chives, vinegar, teaspoon, one fourth a teaspoon of garlic, and, Wait, and half a teaspoon of sugar. Where's the sour cream? Ew. Can you open it? Like, that's not creepy. A sour cream? No, open it. Chives. Ew. Aaron, you're getting chives all over the floor. Okay, go. Okay, olive oil. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, here are the two Beyond Meat burgers. So, gonna cut this open. Mm? Only a little bit of mine. That's perfect. Can you put the pickles on a little question? Yeah. There are the greens. Wonderful. Wonderful. There it is. Beautiful. Oh. Pretty similar if you ask me. Good morning. Oh my god, the lighting. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. Not like it's any other day. It feels like any other day. It is 8.29 and I have to hop on a work meeting call. So I literally just rolled out of bed. Brought down my water bottle. Gonna start drinking some water. But need to hop on this meeting on Zoom for about 15 to 20 minutes and then we will proceed with my morning, but it's very early. Since I've had the ability to sleep in, it's been a little nicer, but I've only been sleeping in until like 9.30, so it's not that big of a difference. But yes, starting off my quarantine day with a meeting, and then we'll go on with the day, so stay tuned. Okay, I have my whole workout set up here. This is the Sarah's Day class that I'll be doing today. It's kind of like a lower intensity one, um, but it's still super, super challenging. 
So I will be doing that. So with the Sarah's Day workouts, she actually has an app. I believe I showed this in my previous vlog as well, but it's called the Sarah's Day Fitness Timer and every workout has its own timer. So the sweaty shredder will correspond to the sweaty shredder workout. Um, and today we're doing toning power. So the timing works perfectly with the sets. So it's super helpful so you don't have to like make your own time or anything. It all is in this app. Okay, workouts are done. That is it, over an hour of that. So, time to shower. My hair is full of sweat and gel and grease. Oh well. I'm gonna shower now and then prepare breakfast. I'm gonna have a smoothie. What are you gonna eat? Eggs. Eggs. So, let's go wash up and catch our breakfast. <laughs> One job, Erin. One job to organize, and she does this. Well, in case anybody wants pasta tonight, no one's having spaghetti. For lunch, I made one piece of toast with avocado and an egg, and the other one has peanut butter with some fruit, cinnamon, and honey on it. I couldn't decide if I wanted sweet or savory, so I went with both. Coffee time, sex education. Okay. Erin. Okay, it is 3.18 and we are bored. We had a little snack, we watched some Netflix, and now we're going to paint. We have our canvas, way more paintbrushes at the bigger table where we're gonna be painting, but here are some of the paints. And yeah, this is, this, afternoon is a paint this is the current situation. We have a very fun little arts and crafts. I won't say very fun. Okay, well, it's not very fun, but you know, it's quite the entertainment for today. Um, but yeah, just sitting here watching some YouTube videos and painting away. Happy Wednesday. <laughs> okay, we have finished the paintings. They look so good. Aaron did a hamsa. I did some evil eyes. And yeah. Should we eat some more? Hi. Kill me. What's up? Are we okay, we have to leave the house. It is Friday. We haven't left in days But I'd rather I leave the house as opposed to my parents um, We do need to get just essentials some groceries for the house So I'm gonna go out and get that but unfortunately we do need to leave the house for some things just to you know live So hopping into a grocery store really really quickly gonna grab some food items and then Push -up challenge. That's it. I'm sorry, but wine is a necessity to live so gotta get it. We're going back home Self-isolation. We just want to give the necessities. Stay home. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here. Wash your damn yours. hands. Wash your damn hands. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. <laughs> it's simple as that. It's not rocket science. But don't go out. You give it a little tuck tuck right with some soap. You don't need to be with your friends right now. You don't need to be with your boyfriend right now. Unless you're staying with your boyfriends for six weeks. Other than that, your boyfriend can wait. <laughs> your friends can wait. <laughs> Shit can wait. Shit can wait. I'm gonna try to wake up by 10 in the morning, go to Landwer, and then come home and tan. Not do this. Just so stay home. Thank you. Goodbye. Stay home. If you guys, what is my hair? This is what self isolation looks like. If you guys have watched my previous vlogs, you would see that my family and I started this new tradition where on Sundays we usually drive to a coffee shop somewhere downtown Toronto, just go for a nice drive together, enjoy a nice coffee together. We were only able to do that a couple times, and now we are isolated. So, 
no coffee shops, no nothing. So what we're doing is we're making coffees at home and we're going to go in the car, not get out of the car, not stop anywhere, but just go for a drive just to get out of the house. Um, but obviously we're not going to get out of the car. Um, but just for a change of scenery, just to kind of get back to our old routine, but just adjusting to what we need to do now. So, making our own coffees and going for a little drive together is our new tradition for now. Tom Slash hits one. Got our coffees and we're driving. You might have heard this song. We are currently just driving down the Prado Path, looking at all the beautiful mansions because what else is there to do? Slash hits one. My name is Mikey Pip. This is hit bad because a lot. See, of like this is a problem because wow. that's not social distancing at all. Like, are you joking, people? We need food, okay? We just we need it. Good morning. I just had a phone call or a Zoom call, if you guys know what Zoom is. Zoom is like an online meeting thing, but we're using it for the school I work at now because obviously we're not in school. So that was really, really great. I love seeing the students because I really miss them. And I just miss the routine of going to work and seeing them. So seeing them over a screen is good enough. But now that's done, I have a workout starting in five minutes. Um, I'm going to be doing the Instagram Live Fit Square class, so I'll be doing that. I've done it every morning, I think, for like the past week, which has been great. Getting started on my water. It's making a weird noise. Forgot to vlog this before I dug in, but I'm just having half protein yogurt, half chia seeds, uh, chia seed pudding for breakfast. Um, and I just topped it with some fruit, some hemp hearts, pumpkin seeds, and coconut flakes. Dug into that already. And then I'm having a cappuccino, and I put some cocoa powder on top. But some chocolate. But yeah, this I just made the yogurt with 0% fat yogurt and some protein powder and then my cheesy pudding I made and I leave overnight. Mm -hmm. Booster shot, I've been taking one every day, as has Aaron. Um, and yeah, they're from Rabatta Size, they're the best. Delicious. Okay, that is it for this vlog. This was kind of like a pre-COVID-19 quarantine vibe and then the first week of us being in quarantine. Um, I am working from home. It is going well so far. Obviously, it would be more ideal to be at work, um, but due to the circumstances, I think half the world is working from home. So, we're working with it, we're managing. Um, I've probably gained 20 pounds so far, as all I'm doing is eating. While I am uploading this video, I am going to be editing a kind of nighttime routine thing. So, this was vlog footage that I had from before, and I really wanted to upload it, and then I kind of just added in what we've been doing during the day while we've been in quarantine and self-isolation, but I'm actually currently editing another video that is our nighttime routine. So what are we up to at nights while in quarantine? What are we doing? How are we keeping ourselves entertained? That'll be in my upcoming video. But I just wanted to add in this footage from Purim and when life was awesome and regular and normal as opposed to how it is now. So I hope everyone is staying safe, staying healthy, staying isolated at home, making smart decisions. And yes, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up this video, put the little notification bell thing so you get notified when I upload more videos. And that's really it. Gonna go edit the night routine vlog. I can't even talk. Gonna go edit the night routine vlog and get that up for you guys shortly. I have some other good ideas for some YouTube videos, so hopefully I'll be able to put those together this weekend. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and see you in the next video. Bye!